So let's see, where were we? Oh yeah, we were on the navigation. Um, so navigation will wind up being, um, did that. Oh, what did I do there? I typed it in the wrong spot. And it'll be easier just to do this. Silly fool. Now they're hyperlinks. Good, good. All right, so, um, oh, we were down to the article. Article written by header uh, P, so we need a paragraph. And uh, body of the article slash P. Let's go ahead and save that. Yep, very good. Looks like we got some stuff going on there. Really should just put these guys in as a template of some kind. Yup, yup. Um, next we got the footer. So we're gonna make that a div as well. And we're gonna call it uh, oh. Well, actually we need to do footer slash footer spacing's gotten a little bit off that's fine div and its uh, ID is going to be equals footer div not very creative with the names I know uh, so let's uh, close that div copy this so that way I'll know which div I'm closing there because there's nothing worse than having five divs closing at once and you can't remember which one's which and in there we're going to do um, we'll do a uh, small why not small p by Small, save, refresh. There we go. Um, you know, I think that's uh, that's pretty close to all the HTML. Um, I actually have a logo that I want to use because I did make a dumb little logo for this video. So we'll do um, image source equals open quotes uh, picks slash logo dot png and it's going to be a class. logo and slogan because it's going to wind up being huge if I don't do something to it yeah it's humongous uh, so let's go ahead and uh, we'll copy that again Copy. Because all I gotta do is just change this to slogan.png, save, refresh. Oh, there we go. Yes. Um, honestly, I think that's like all the HTML that I need. So uh, let's put some styling on it. Um, 
first off, what's wrong with it? The uh, logo and slogan are a little large. That's a class. So, oop. got a little crazy there. Dot logo dot class. And uh, we're going to reference the images in there. So, width is going to be 200 picks. Save that. Oh no, that's just the class. I don't even need to reference image. Let's lower it to 150 or 100. Yeah, 150 is probably better. Alright, so those guys are supposed to uh, float left. So I believe I had a class called uh, float left. And um, that's going to be float left. Let's refresh that. Yep. Also had a class float right. Float right. And that's supposed to uh, float right. Semicolon. Save that. Yep. Then there's going to be um, one called root clear float. Root clear float. And that one's actually going to be clear both. Oh, both. Both. Save that. And specifically, let's look at the code again. Where's root clear float? There it is. And it's in header div. So we're going to chain up some stuff here. Copy. Dot header div space. So when root clear float is in the header div, um, width should be 100%. Save that. Yeah, and that what that does is it takes up the whole width and then pushes all that other stuff down. Okay, so now let's put um, let's fix the navigation menu. Uh, What's the navigation menu called? UL navigation list. Copy that. That was an ID, right? Yep, that's an ID, so that's a hashtag. Paste that in there. And uh, should be able to display inline block. Save that. Oh, I have to do it on the uh, list items. Yeah, there we go. Uh, let's center them. So we'll do um, margin of uh, zero picks. And that'll do the top. And I could do auto for the right side. Zero picks for the bottom auto for the left side, but I can also shorten it, and then it, with just the two, that'll do both the top and the bottom, and then the left and the right side, so let's save that, 
refresh huh margin auto oh wait I probably need to put that what if I just put that on navigation list with padding hmm because I think I could just do 10 picks same yeah and then if I do navigation list with uh, the same way that'll center the list I think hmm Let's put a width on it. Width 100%. We'll do a. Oh, wait. Auto. Save that. Width 100%. Huh. Well, it still looks good anyway. Save that. Alright, so the video is getting kind of long. Let's go ahead and pause it again here.